Swinburne University was founded in 1908. In 1992, we officially became a university. Swinburne University comprises of three main campuses and a satellite campus within Melbourne. The university currently has approximately 50,000 students and 2,500 staff. The initial uh, problem we were looking at when looking into facial recognition was around the security of the university. We found that adding analytics to our milestone CCTV package has been really beneficial in trying to get that um, automated process. And the facial recognition is more around trying to identify people as they walk onto campus or through campus. Typically the, uh, the types of uh, persons of interest we're looking for um, come from our student cohort. Uh, we'll have a particular student that will be excluded from the university. They feel, still feel a tight link or perhaps feel wronged by the university and so continue to come onto campus. In the past we've relied on security staff patrolling the campus to keep an eye out, identify these people from a photo board in the office. Uh, we're looking to the facial recognition software to eliminate that for us, give us better response times to identifying people when they come onto campus in the first instance before they can cause any issues. So we did go out and have a look at what the market offered. We looked at some of the big vendors and players and were surprised about the costs they were talking about and the amount of hardware and complexity of their solutions. We came across images and were pleasantly surprised that it's quite a unique offering and that it's cost effective and the hardware is stock standard hardware that's easily available. Uh, the relationship between Images and Milestone is a very close and a very good one. We found Milestone to be an exceptional security uh, platform. Um, we were introduced to them through um, one of our partner companies. They've now implemented their software, fully integrated it into the Milestone platform. One of the things that impressed me most about the Images is that the, the, the technology itself is designed around the ability to pick non-compliant facial detection. So these are the people that are, are looking to avoid camera detection or not specifically trying to be detected. Face down, there's a cap on, there's some glasses, and so it needs less detail to be able to get a picture match or a face match on that individual. One of the reasons Images is a more cost-effective solution is due to the way that we utilise or have used our software in using the NVIDIA's deep learning technology. This means that we can have a more scalable solution using multiple NVIDIA cards rather than having expensive hardware driven by CPUs. By leveraging the NVIDIA hardware, it allows them to deploy a technology solution that's extremely advanced without having to have highly customised, highly bespoke systems, which of course then become quite fragile. So it's a very standardised package that's easy to deploy, but it's exceptionally powerful because it leverages uh, deep learning on the NVIDIA cards. So having the three products working in unison, that's Milestone, Images and NVIDIA, is a really solid solution. They reach the best in their fields and they work really well together. I think one of the benefits that Swinburne saw about the Images solution was actually our plug-in into Milestone. From a milestone customer experience perspective, when they log into the client, which is the, the view of the world that they see through the milestone, where all the cameras are streaming, there'll be a tab called images, it will look exactly like milestone, it will feel like milestone. So the change management for a customer to adopt this technology is not learning a new piece of software, not educating all of the, the operating staff, it's just an extension of what they already know. It's not too dissimilar to putting a new application in Windows and the buttons all look the same and feel the same. And also we've now increased the accuracy over the time of working with Swinburne. It's been an extremely good partnership together uh, and this has enabled us to increase our accuracy, um, reduce the size of our databases and, and really enhance the system to a major degree. The Images solution has allowed us to become even more agile and reactive to what we're seeing on our campus and our cameras. We're getting that early intervention that, that we're looking for. We can get to someone before they reach a staff member's office who they may feel aggrieved by to try and have a conversation with them. So we'd recommend images to other universities and, and surveillance customers because it's a flexible solution, it's cost effective, it has the potential to be used for far more than it was originally intended, it's easily operated and very minimal maintenance. The other main uh, aspect that, that we quite like is that they are an Australian company and we do like to support Australian companies being that we're an Australian university. Yeah, the, having local developers and tech support makes us extremely responsive to the client. At the end of the day the client is, is king. Um, we always want to make sure our customers are looked after in the best way possible.